I'm Justin Grubb. And I'm Alex Getz, and we are wildlife filmmakers. We travel the world to get up close to all sorts of incredible wildlife. Our mission is to give you an animal's eye view of their world. We are here in the heart of Namibia, known for its hot, blazing sun and dry, boulderous mountains. Very little can survive out here, and if it does, it has to be highly adapted to living life in the desert. We are looking for a little fuzzy mammal that loves to hang out in the shady crevices of rock outcroppings scattered across Africa. This animal is very shy and secretive. Having sharp vision, they can spot a predator 1,000 feet away. So we have to be most tactical in sneaking up on them. What on earth are you doing? So we set up our gear and wait. And suddenly, an explosion of movement. Oh, oh, there they are, there they are. This is the fuzzy fanged face of the rock hyrax. These odd little critters have evolved to climb. This rock hyrax is able to boulder up these rock faces with such ease because he uses a suction cup-like adaptation in the middle of his foot. They do this to avoid predation. And when you're a nine pound fuzzball living in the desert, you're bound to be popular with the local carnivores. So the hyrax bears a striking resemblance to another animal that lives out here in the wilds of Africa. Just look at those little tusks. Look at those little buck teeth. So the rock dasi, also known as the hyrax, which is actually the closest living relative to the elephant. Think about that for a second. An animal that's about this big is related to the largest land animal in the world. And they are close relatives too. The Hyrex even has the same number of toes as an elephant. Four toes in the front feet and three toes on the back. They mainly forage for plant material near their home, but will sometimes eat small insects. For protection from predators like leopards, jackals, and snakes, a single Hyrex will post up high and be on the lookout for danger. When it spots something, it'll vocalize a loud trill, warning all the other Hyrexes in the social group to run for their lives and hide amongst the rocks. Each group is led by a dominant male who marks his territory using an odor-producing gland on his back, which is unique to these animals. These social groups can be as large as 50 individuals, all sharing quarters in this same rock pile. The rock hyrax is an animal with a busy schedule, which is a joke, of course, because, well, these animals spend most of their time just staring. Just staring. In fact, they say about 5% of their day involves doing something like eating or running. Makes me kind of jealous of their lifestyle. This has been one amazing wildlife encounter. Face to face with the closest living relative to the largest land animal on earth, the elephant. <laughs>